to be attractive today in the market, you need to take a statement and strive to be a people, planet, positive company. We think we need to take a step forward to be more innovative because we think that using technology is the key to a sustainable world. En France, les entreprises sont incitées à embaucher des personnes en situation de handicap. Notre offre en Diredi en fait, permet de répondre à ce sujet. Donc, nous avons sélectionné des profils, nous avons formé. Aujourd'hui, ils sont intégrés à l'ensemble de notre projet. La formation AppDesk nous a permis de pouvoir donc, intégrer le poste. Donc, ce qu'on a vu en formation, on le répercute également sur notre emploi aujourd'hui. C'était assez enrichissant. Personnellement, pour moi, j'ai adoré. EDF prend à cœur de participer à ce type de réinsertion professionnelle. On croit beaucoup en la valeur ajoutée. Ça permet de créer de la diversité et également d'apporter vraiment de l'empathie face au travail. CGI participated in developing a roadmap for fossil-free Sweden. And the aim is that Sweden is supposed to be the first country in the world to be fossil-free. And we think that technology is the enabler of actually reaching that objective. One thing I'm very proud of is the engagement CGI has within the community. We have an opportunity to share ideas, but also to get new ideas and influences from youngsters and students from the university. Oh wow, <laughs> I got a lot of inspiration today. I think just to see that you can work with different sectors and all the problems that we might be facing, that there are solutions to them, and how digitalization can be such a big part of it. We've conducted many STEM camps, but we've always conducted them individually. So now we're doing something different. We're doing it with a client, and this client happened to be very passionate about students, the American School for the Deaf. At the end of the day, it's about the individual. It's about igniting the passion, creating the opportunity, showing them the future, and then helping them go on that path. CGI sends Malawi 230 computers per year, uh, which is made up mainly of desktop computers, but also some laptop computers. So one example of how we affected life there, we went to school for girls and we took the Raspberry Pis with us um, and the children were playing with them and learning how to code them and some of the young girls actually said they wanted to have jobs in coding and developing. This project definitely makes me proud to be a CGI member. It's not just about sending out goods and help and so on, it's about providing knowledge as well so that the people can use the products or use the things that have been sent out. And that is very much what this project is about as well. These initiatives are key in terms of CGI's business philosophy. The implementation of the CSR projects is very important to our members and the overall member satisfaction. The scholarship that I received is in part funding, but also in part mentorship and guidance that's provided by CGI directly to me. But it also helps me out because I have someone who can provide me with mentorship and guide me in my career. One of the focuses was how do we increase the number of women in the IT field and keep them within the Halifax community? Because it's not enough to 
attract women into computer science. We need to make sure that the transition to early career and to places in industry is exciting, that they get career acceleration. If we're going to have more female leaders in technology.